What's up, everybody? Today on today's Tip Tuesday, we're going to take a look at a just a quick tip that might help a lot of you guys that don't have the ability to record yourself or have any way of seeing how you throw, but you want instant feedback of how you're throwing. Uh, I think we might have something for you. Okay, so what is it? So if you're out in the field, I tend to end up being out in the fields a lot because I do, you know, disc reviews and tips. So I end up being out in the fields a lot. And I always carry with me an extra putter or two because when I'm out here, I'll use it to warm up before I start throwing the discs I'm doing reviews on. And I'll also do field work after and during the filming. It's why putters? Well, especially straight putters. Like these are Prodigy PA3s. Dead straight, not understable, not overstable. They'll just go straight. Uh, I practice side arming, standstills, run ups, controlled shots, distance shots. Uh, I love to come out here where there's a soccer nets out and I will try to throw into soccer nets at different distances. Um, but why did I chose putters? Well, it's simple. They're going to tell me what I'm doing. If I let go of this putter like this, it's going to fly like this. If I let go of this putter like this, it's going to fly like this. Go nose down and go straight in the ground. Putters are a great tool to get. Excuse me. Putters are a great tool to get instant feedback on what you're doing, and it can tell you everything you need to know. What you're doing. Now, granted, with the video, you can see your form and know if your elbows up or down, leaning back. But in general, the putter flight will tell you. Oh, I released that on the anhyzer. Oh, I released that on a hyzer. Oh, I released that nose up. Oh, I threw the nose down. It'll give you all that information. Instantly, as soon as you let it go, you know, oh, that's what I did. And I think a lot of people, when they go to the field, they grab their distance drivers and they just go ham. They just like, oh, I'm gonna throw five million feet. No, that's all I'm gonna do. Put those, leave those at home. Don't even bring them with you. Don't go, oh, I like this tip. I'm gonna go do it. And then bring your whole bag out because what's gonna end up happening is you're gonna throw the putter once or twice and then you're gonna throw that driver like 400 feet. And then you're gonna keep trying to throw that driver. Leave all the other discount. Grab your putters, bring them out. I love it. It's gotten me to where I can throw a putter confidently around 350 feet if I have a ceiling high enough to get it there. Uh, I have supreme confidence in throwing putters. I love the grip on them. They feel good in my hands. And I just I have a lot of confidence with putters. And that's because I'm out here a lot doing just random field work. Um, i give you a quick example. Like I'm, I'm staring at these nets and I just want to throw into them real quick. So let me spin you around here. So, those of you that have watched uh, a lot of other videos have seen me throw into random nets doing disc reviews. This is what I'm talking about. I mean, look around. There's nets everywhere. At any distance, I have, I'm standing on concrete right now. I can, I can do run-ups and simulate like I'm on a tee pad. I can do run-ups in the grass with my putters. You know, I can practice everything I want to practice with and just have my putters. So, I think on this super quick tip, when you go out to the field, take your putters. It's going to give you instant feedback. You're going to love it, and it's you just you don't have to rely on anybody. You don't have to rely on a camera or setting your you know $600, $800, $1,000 phone on the ground pointing at you. You don't have to rely on any of that. Just grab your putters and go out and throw. 